Hi everyone, I'm Ishan Sharma. Data science is an ever expanding field at this point. There are tons and tons of companies out there who are collecting more than ever data about the users and they need someone who can analyze the data, who can create the models and can predict user behavior. And in this video, I want to talk about exactly how can you learn about data science? What are the salaries that you can expect? And if you watch till the end, I will be talking about some free resources as well. Make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel and let's get started with data science. So this is back in 10th grade when I was looking at the headlines. The one headline that intrigued me the most was this data scientist, the hottest job of the 21st century with an average pay of $100,000 a year in US. And this was really interesting. I think this is what got me interested and motivated to study for engineering. And we all know how that went. But the more important point is how can you learn about data science and what is the scope and the career like of a data scientist? Well, I have interviewed three different professionals in this field. Number one, a data engineering freelancer who was making three lakhs per month. I have interviewed him on my channel. I have also interviewed a Coursera data scientist and she talks about her whole journey of getting in it. What is her day in the life like and what tasks does she do in this job particularly. I have also interviewed Aishwarya Srinivasan who used to work at IBM as a data scientist and she shares her journey as well. The links of all these videos are going to be in the description so go take a look at that but here I want to tell you the salaries that you can expect as a data scientist living in India. So as you can see on your screen this is levels.fii I just went in here and I just typed for data science and this is what I can see right here let me just go on to the first page and you can see exactly what company is offering how much package in India and you can see the exact city, you can see the exact level of the software engineer and you can see what is the base salary like, what is the stock compensation and what is the bonus that they get when they are joining the company. So this is a really helpful tool. You can go around and you can take a look at how much it is that a data scientist is earning in India. Now the average salary of a data scientist in India is somewhere about eight to 10 lakhs. But if you go take a look at the high growth startups, they end up paying even 20, 30 and 40 lakhs per year for a data scientist living in India, which is pretty crazy if you think about it. So this is what you can earn. You can of course go on to these websites like levels.fi to get a clear idea. Like for example, at Microsoft, they pay about $143,000 in India for a data scientist. Then there are other ones like you have Flipkart. Flipkart is paying about $61,000 per year. Then you have other companies as well, right? You have Intel, you have Amazon, you have PayPal. So go take a look at this. But the next part is how can you start learning about data science? Resource number one is the free masterclasses that are conducted by Scalar Academy, right? So Scalar Academy has a ton of masterclasses happening around data science every single month. Masterclasses like learn and build a Netflix like pricing model using data science that you can watch for completely free. How to become a data scientist at the world top data companies by Mudit, web analytics and personalization using data science. And you also have learn the art and science of data visualization. You can check out the link in description and see the latest events that are going to happen. Like for example, this one, how to become a data scientist at world's top companies. If you want to learn Python, first of all, you can take a look at this guide that they have about Python itself. So you can go in here and you can learn about what is Python, the different syntax in Python, you know, building classes and objects in Python, creating your own functions. You can learn about all of that with the help of Scalar Topics. Scalar Academy also offers some great data science courses that you can take to upscale yourself, get one-on-one -on -one mentorship with data science professionals, and you also get to build hands-on projects, which is really important. You can learn about all of these using the link in the description. First of all, learn about the mathematics behind data science. So go take a look at this free code camp tutorial that is about linear algebra. It's a full college course that you can consume to learn about the basics of how does the math behind data science work? So learn about this, learn about matrices, learn about determinants, learn about matrix multiplication. And once you do that, then we can move ahead. On the MIT OCW YouTube channel, there is also this really interesting linear algebra course. It is run by Gilbert Strang and he is a great professor. I too consumed a bunch of the lectures to understand exactly what is it that my courses are talking about. So you can take a look at this. I learned a lot from this course as well. So this is going to be a great starting point for you. They have about 70 lectures that you can consume and you can properly learn about linear algebra. If you are more of a visual kind of a person, you can also consume these videos from 3Blue, 1 Brown to learn about all of these concepts in a lot more visual manner. So as you can see, there is this playlist, which is the essence of linear algebra. So this one will take you through all of these things, right? 
uh, eigenvectors, eigenvalues, how do you change the basis, all of these things will be taught to you right here. Matrices, determinants, multiplication, linear transformation, span of a matrix and stuff like that. Next step is to learn about probability and statistics with the help of this course on MIT OCW itself, which will take you through all the different probability types, all the different examples, all the different axioms that they have. And you can learn all of this with the help of this one course. And you will get to learn about the basic probability concepts. But once you're done with linear algebra as well as probability and statistics, the next step is going to be to actually start tinkering with some of the frameworks to actually start building out some models learn about pandas, numpy, you know, learn about matplotlib and then start building out a few of your models. A great course to get started with is going to be this Coursera professional certificate, which is from IBM on data science itself. They talk about tools for data science, data science methodology, Python for data science, AI and development, Python project for data science. You also learn about databases and SQL for data science with Python. There is a course on data analysis, data visualization, machine learning and applied data science capstone project at the very end. 10 courses, a great starting point if you want to learn about this field. Also, if you have any doubts about auditing a course and getting it for free on Coursera, just tell me in the comment section if you have a doubt like that. If you're confused about how to audit a course on Coursera, it's very simple. Just go on to any course, not a certificate, only a course and click on enroll for free right here and just click on next and then you can get started in this field click on audit right here and that is all that you need that's how you do it that's how you get the course for free on coursera the next one is going to be another specialization or a certificate so this one is called as the google data analytics professional certificate it's from google let's just take a look at what courses does it have so you first of all learn about the foundation of data why is it everywhere why is it important to companies all of those other cliched data science codes right there what questions you need to ask in a data driven business this again is very important for you to always learn if you are getting a job in product based companies you first learn to prepare data for exploration then you will learn how to process it you will also learn how to analyze data to answer questions better you also learn about how to share this data and show it to other people we'll also learn about data analysis with R programming you will also at the end do a project it's going to be a case study and this is going to be the final thing that you will do at the very end. So this is the second certificate that you can explore. Now, will you get the certificate? You can if you apply for financial aid, but uh, it's not of much use, honestly. When you make your own case studies, when you make your own models in your data science learning journey, that is gonna be really important and much more valuable, honestly speaking. Then we have this data science specialization from John Hopkins University that you can get access to. And this is gonna be similar to the previous ones. It's going to be having, first of all, the basic toolkit that you need to know. This, this will basically be talking about, you know, Google Colab or IPython notebook, basically Jupyter. And then it'll take you into the different frameworks that you will be using when building your own models in data science. You learn about R programming, you learn about clean data, learn about exploring data, and you will also learn about how to create, how to research, right? How do you come up with statistical inferences? You'll also learn about regression models, how to actually create a model with using the data that you already have. You also learn about practical applied machine learning, and this is another great course for you to take if you want to learn about data science. At the end, I just want to plug in a great creator on YouTube. Daniel has some amazing content about data science and machine learning that you can go through and you can learn about how to build out your models, what books you need to use, what is the roadmap like that you need to follow. So go take a look at this channel. You will learn a lot in the process. And that is all that we have for this video. I hope you got to learn something from this. Make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe. Share this video with your friends on social and tag me at Ishan Sharma 7390. Go take a look at the Scalar Academy if you want to take part in the master classes and learn about data science in depth with the link in the description. Thank you so much. If you're still watching, just write in the comment section. I watched till the end. If you have any other question about data science, let me know about that as well. All of these courses are linked in the description. Go take a look at that. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye-bye.